fans and talk to you since you came back. How, how good has it been to be back in your hometown playing for Florida State? Man, it's been excellent, man. Um, always growing up as a kid, you always hear about great guys, uh, Duran James, Jalen Ramsey, just guys from the area playing for this. Growing up as a kid, hearing the sound, hearing the stadium. So it's been great, man. I love being home with my family. I love this coaching staff. When you made the decision to leave Maryland, did you know you were always going to end up here? Was that the plan for you No, <laughs> nah, man, never. I, I Honestly, I, I never thought I was going to be here. I never said that when I entered the port, I'm going to come to Florida State. It was just one of those things that was, for me, uh, I'm a big believer in God, so it was just like faith. So it just ended up happening for me. It definitely has its challenges. Uh, I say for me, it's been uh, my coach, Coach Chris Marv, uh, does a great job of teaching me. Why well, there's extra film, extra extra notes. So it's been a lot of great things, but uh, it's, it's been its challenges, but I'm adjusting really well. And it's a day by day thing. So every day I'm trying to get better, constantly learning, constantly asking the questions, trying to be the best version of myself. What's been the most difficult part of that? I would say for me, uh, just knowing what everybody else has to do in front of me. You know, me being a linebacker, I got to know not just my job, but what my D lineman is doing, because that affects my gaps, what my secondary is doing, because that affects who my support player is. So just stuff like that. Four three. Uh, it was a little similar. It had the similarities as far as uh, gap schemes, and certain fits to be at. Has there been a particular guy that's kind of helped you along with learning this scheme here? Give me a crash course. I would say really my coach, my position coach, does a great job of really just making sure I'm understanding. Even if I'm even if I'm not sure, like I, I'm not a perfect guy at all. So even if I'm not sure, he'll come up to me like Tez, Okay, is this? He's a great teacher to me. He's been like that since I got here. Rather it's one on one time or whether I'm on the field, he always helps me out. Even early in camp, I saw you like teaching some of the younger linebacker stuff just because you're, even though you're new here, but right. do you enjoy that? Role yeah, that, that part of that? yeah, man, I love it, man, because that older guy, you got to help young guys. I once was a young guy, too, as a freshman, so I know how I feel to come into all of this. It's, it's very, it'll make your head spin. So I think I love just teaching young guys just the way, just working hard. If you, even if you don't know, like I'm, I'm a sophomore now, no question is a dumb question. So I, I don't want guys to feel like, oh, what I got to do? I always ask questions. I do it, so I tell young guys to do the same thing. Man, I, lo I love it here. I love my hometown in Tallahassee. You know, being born and raised here, man, I love the weather. I love the people. I love, you know, Florida State, the atmosphere, man. So it's been great. I've been very happy. Uh, every day is a new day for me. Never look at the past. Every time I get a chance to get better, grow as a person, as a player, as a man. So it's been a great thing. Did, they, did you feel like as soon as you got here, they were treating you as a guy that like, could contribute, not just a guy who's Honestly, man, my mindset for me was just coming in here every day and just working for everything I get. I didn't want, I didn't need nobody to tell me where I was going to be at, what my contribution was. I just wanted to come here and work every day, every day, be the best version of me. And when that day I went, do the same thing the next day and work for everything I, I can get. Uh, I would say for me, I, I'm a physical linebacker. I love contact. I love coming down here, making plays. I love filling gaps. Uh, I would say things I got to work on is just uh, understanding where all my help is, like I constantly said, knowing what my supporter is, knowing what my D-line is doing. Just worry about what the whole defense is doing. I know my job, my role. I need to make sure that I know my, what the whole defense is doing. Did you know Amari Gaynor from high school? <laughs> Me and Amari go way back, man. Close friend of mine, 7 on 17. He loved for us. He knew he was coming here since he was in middle school. So as a close friend of, friend of mine, and since I got here, he's been like a brother to me. Always constantly helping me, whether it's little stuff. Or even when we're in together, we always communicate well, gel together. So he's been a great guy to uh, link up to. Yeah, it's called Tight Action Sports. You probably didn't hear about it. We was like a little local team. Yeah, like I said, anything else? Thank you.